Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. And ladies and gentlemen, fashionistas and hairstylists, welcome our guest, Gert Johan Couture. I mean, what a way to wake up this morning. The first time I've ever seen him with a hat. You have a seat over there. Thank you. Lana, over to you. I love how he goes, hello, hello. I love how he says it's the first time that he sees you with a hat. You know? You look great. Thank you. I you have been fantastic. here since Thursday, so I, hair doesn't tend to last so long. No, but Cape, Cape Town's weather will give you the mince. Do you know what mince is? No It clue. means that your hair will curl. Mm. Yeah, anyway, so he's got the cool. A man who needs no introduction, Hatian Kutsi is with us this morning, bringing all kinds of things as the award season heats up in Hollywood. Now, first I want to know what's happening in your own life. What's new and what's news? In my own life, besides from renovating, we basically <laughs> bought a house, smashed everything down, and now we're building it up again. We are busy working on SA Fashion Week, and that wow. is happening on the 18th of March. And it's amazing, the first time ever you will be able to shop the runway, which is a completely new concept in South Africa. And I think it just shows you how the industry has developed. So I'm super excited about that. I like how you say you can shop the runway. Now, I want to talk more about uh, the award season. You're the go-to guy when it comes to coveted and covetable couture, especially for our celebrities. What are some of the favorite red carpet moments that you can highlight? I must right definitely now. say it, it must be the Kardashians. They did so much for my career and it was such an honor and a blessing. As well as um, Kelly Rowland and Raleen Strauss, who is now Miss World. That's just amazing for South Africa. And then uh, my favorite muse, Sandra Hopper. Those are a couple of my favorite red carpet moments. And you say this because you've actually dressed them. If you've just tuned in, Khadjian Katsia is a coveted designer. He's one of the best in South Africa and he's joining us on the show this morning. What else can you tell me about a show stopping red carpet? dress what makes one because we see your designs and normally they're completed by the time we see them but how do you conceptualize them how do you make and start them you know it just comes to me um in in this vision i don't know i just think of i look at a person feel their energy and see what they like mm. and then i just a design pops into my head and I think what makes a red carpet gun is that element of of surprise as well as that bit of a drama okay well I like the drama and of course one of the dramas that we're expecting for this year's award season is of course the Oscars and we'd like to hear how our nominees will step it up I mean what do you think what should they be stepping out in Oh, you know, I think I, I want to see a lot. If you look at Paris Fashion Week and Milan Fashion Week that just happened, I think we're going to see a very different look on the red carpet. I think we're going to see shorter things. I think we're going to see lots of flowy things and, and also odd color collaborations. Okay, but one of the things that you mentioned earlier, which I'm totally interested in, is the fact that you said we can now shop from the runway a new concept in South Africa. Also, when he talked about bashing all the walls down and renovating, he was in fact talking about him and his husband. But I want to get to South Africa specifically. What can we look forward to in terms of your design, Gert Johan Kutsia's designs? Yeah. Um, this season, we are looking really and doing something for everybody. Um, my, my clothes tend to be very fitting, and I know lots of people don't like to show their curves. So this year, I'm focusing on, on having a more women-friendly collection so that everybody can, can find a piece. I will still have my beautiful fitted body cons and tight corseted red carpet gowns, but also something slightly more comfortable. Okay, well, I love the comfortable look. That, for me, is exciting, and it's also exciting because he just revealed to me in my ear earlier that he'll also be looking after as prego women's and start, start designing some pretty come on you must do it is so simple and easy i don't know why you're struggling yeah there's nothing out there for us eh not even underwear Telephone. Hello, yeah. Khaer, <laughs> Bob and Bella, thank you so much for joining thank us this morning. Thank you for having me. It's so much fun. Extraordinary. We're going to leave him here because it's an honor just having him in studio. Khaer Tian is visiting us this morning talking about fashion and I love their hat. What's under it? Is your hair come? It's it's kind of in a man bun. <laughs> we call it a moni. Is that, isn't that the new term? A I moni. love that. A moni. <laughs> okay. Well, there's lots happening other than just Khaer Tian Kutsia's news. In fact, on the show, we also have the real news.